Alright lads, so today we're going to be reviewing second in form Marcus Berg, plays for Panathinaikos in the Hellas Liga, he's 6 foot tall, right footed, he's at high low work rate, a 4 star weak foot and 3 star skills. Looking at his end games, his stand up to his 92 finishing, 92 attack positioning, 90 shot power, 84 long shot and 84 volleys. We've also included all the upgrades over his first in form as a comparison for you so you can see each individual stat increase over his in form version so you can always pause the video now if you want a closer look at these. So this is the team we'll be using second in form Berg in, a 4-3-3 Hellas Liga team with second in form Berg up top there in the middle as striker. So now onto our gameplay so you can see how Berg performed. So we did actually review normal inform Berg a few weeks ago and now he's back this week with a second inform, another hat trick and assist. Great for Panathinaikos in the Hellas Liga. Now his pace still is the only average mid 70s but to be honest he's not all that bad. Uh, did actually keep ahead of some players, some defenders. Didn't really find it too much of a problem to be honest. And his dribbling is pretty useful for a striker as well. He's got good feet, found his dribbling better than he's normally in form. Now he does have high low work rates and he does have 92 attack positioning so he does make some great attacking runs and he does make himself available for the pass, loses his defenders to make some great space. But the best aspect about the second in form Berg is got to be his shooting. He has had another good upgrade even over his in form version as well so he's now up to 89 shooting on card and he does have 92 finishing and 90 shot power so he does make a great goal scorer up front. And he was so prolific inside of the box as well. Does have his four star weak foot to help him out. So he can take chances on both feet. And he is a pretty physical striker as well. Does have decent strength. I think it's 76 strength. So he is able to hold off the defenders while on his runs. I know he's still quite a lot on his runs. He was using his strength to good effect. And he does have a good long shot as well. He's up to 84 long shots. Unfortunately, we didn't find his range. We did hit the bar quite a lot with his long shots. It is there, but we just didn't crack it. We did crack the bar off it a lot, but we didn't crack his long shots getting in. Uh, but he does have a good long shot, so don't be afraid to try long shots. And does have good heading as well. So can get the headers if you like to cross with his attack position and gets us into some good positions for getting some headers in. And he does have a good short pass for a striker as well. 79 short pass. So he's great on link up play as well. And even created a couple of goals for our team as well. So now let's look at second in Von Berg's performance stats. So in five games he managed to score 10 goals. So averaging two a game. Great for a striker. Also got two assists. All stats are on the left, goals are on the right, position map shows you where goals were scored and assists were created as well. So overall we're going to give second in form Berg a great 8.5 out of 10. Now it's an improvement over his uh, first in form in my opinion. Does have slightly better dribbling, obviously he's got better shooting as well. So he's great shooting wise but he was surprisingly good on the ball as we said he felt comfortable dribbling. And he has his great high low work rates and 92 attack positioning as we said makes him great up top. Great value as well at discard price, so he's well worth a purchase. With discards, highly recommend you go and pick him up. Try some, try some different players. A discard player with 89 shooting is always going to be great and worth building a team around him to give him a go. Price range is 5 to 25k as well. So now we're just going to leave you with second in form Berg's positives and negatives to look at. Would we'll make a great partner up top for Ebra. Two beasts up top would we'll cause some real damage for you. In a Swedish team, or if you want to go for a Hellas Liga team, very underused league, and I'd highly recommend you giving it a go, to be honest. There's some decent players. So hopefully you did enjoy this review. If you did, please leave a like. It does help out a lot. And subscribe to the channel if you're new. We try to do the most in-depth reviews as we can on YouTube. Loads more on our channel to check out as well. Please check out all the other videos. Loads more to come as well, so stay tuned for that. Cheers, lads. Thanks a lot for watching, and peace.